Tell me what tonight means to you. Tonight is really important to me because it's the critics and our peers giving out the awards and I think that's really special that um, I think it's just really important to us because it's the people who we work with that are really picking who they think did the best this year that year who really deserves the award and so I think that's really cool. It seems like you guys always seem to sweep the award shows. Uh, Is it surprising or have you kind of gotten used to all the uh, attention that Modern Family gets? It's always surprising and very flattering every time something like that happens. You know, to us, we're like, wow, I can't believe they're they're honoring us like this or they're recognizing our show. We're only in our third season. I mean, to us, it's, it's insane. We're getting awards in our first season. So to us, it's kind of like, wow. Now, I can imagine when you're on set shooting, it's really hard to keep a straight face. Definitely. We're laughing so hard all the time. But, you know, we've kind of learned. We train ourselves to be like, do not laugh until the minute they say cut. The minute they say cut, everybody is on the floor rolling. For those of us who aren't lucky enough to be there watching you guys film, what is the funniest, most outrageous thing that you've ever seen happen on set? I've seen a lot of things happen. I've seen, wow, there's a lot of stuff. Uh, Physical humor, naked oh yeah. humor, anything? Uh, all. <laughs> um, Julie Bowen one time was trying to make a joke. And... Oh, hmm. Yeah, that's a nice the joke failed. Like, she tried four times. She just kept, she said the joke and nobody got it. She said it again and nobody got it. She said it a third time. We got half the joke and we were like, we don't get the other part. She said it again and it just stopped. And everybody finally, like, got it after 15 minutes and then everybody just started laughing. It was one of the funniest things. But we also have just, like, some really random stuff like that, that happens where somebody will forget a word that's in their line and they'll keep saying it, like, 20 times and finally they won't remember the word. It's just, we have so much funny stuff. Sounds like a blast. Lastly, when you're just looking to disconnect and watch some mindless TV for like maybe an hour, what do you go to? Toddlers and Tiaras. Really? Because what it's is really it? Mindless. Very. What do you think of those poor girls? I think it's incredibly sad that, that that's true, that that's what happens. I mean, I have nothing against the little girls getting dressed up and going into a pageant, but the false eyelashes and the spray tans for four year olds is just no. I don't agree. Any summer plans? Are you working? Uh, I actually am doing a new DreamWorks animated film called Mr. Peabody and Sherman with Ty Burrell for my show, so I'm really excited about that. Um, and also, I just released a cover song today on YouTube with Jackson Guthy called, uh, it's a cover of the song Somebody That I Used To Know, so check that out. It's online. I'm really excited about it. Tell all our viewers. It's so exciting. Congrats. Thank you. Thank you.